living in all ten dimensions. All the, all, all the ten dimensions are in mind, projections of mind, and the extension of the ten dimensions is the extension of our body. And the intermediate way of understanding this is through the chakras. Now don't dismiss the chakras, or if you're a new ager, don't dismiss the dimensions. So where we get that, you know, the horizontal line from one to two, where that crosses the, the central pillar of consciousness is the third eye. So the first and second dimensions together are the third eye, seeing the movement, which is the one on the surface, the background, the face is the two. So we see a cartoon drama, a line drawing of memories, of relationships, of happenings, of projections, of feelings, of intuitions. In opening the third eye, it is still only seeing a line a moving line on a background, a cartoon, a moving cartoon. This is in the third eye. This is in our minds, our, our third eye, our inner, inner eye, which we see from the number five in the heart, the self, but the self is the ego, the avatar, the avatar, the incarnation of the point at the zero, the true self, the shining self, Brahman. So we see as the observer and in the fifth dimension and at that time from the heart we see in the third eye the cartoon memory of our lives and of our future in you know, negotiations with life and interactions. A cartoon drawing of lines and circles of shapes moving on a, on a background. And then we expect following our understanding of the first dimension, that there will be karma, that there will be consequences of actions, that we will see things follow a certain course. From our relationships with the face from five to two, we can see the equal rights and justice, whether we are treated equally, whether the others are treated equally in society by the system or whether if their face fits or they come from a different class or a different race whether they are family homes or whether they are homeless whether their ancestors have stolen land by bloody force from us and imposed their monarchy, monarchy bullshit on us with stolen land, with our stolen land. This is what we see in the one, two, five triangle, the video signal, the level of quantum mechanics, the video signal. From this cartoon, this passing cartoon, this moving image, we come on to the three, four, eight triangle. Three, four is the space time. Three is space, four is time. This is the three, four, eight triangle is the triangle of the audio signal of relativity. But where that three, four line crosses the central column of 
pillar of consciousness is the throat chakra. So you see in this living in the ten dimensions, we've moved from the third eye down to the throat chakra. We're actually expanding our physical extension. And the world is an extension of the extension of our bodies in our minds. So from that cartoon and those relationships, we then come under the realm of relativity, the audio signal, the relationships with people, the actual emotional the t reactions with them in space and time, rather than just being an image that's, you know, a continuous image of past and present and future. We're actually involved in a, in a situation we're actually going from place to place and time to time. We're actually involved in the narrative, in the story, in the conversation, in the relationships, in the energy, because the eight is the sexual center and that drives our actions over space time. Or eight is the energy determines the levels of actions in space and time. But it's the same thing, you know, uh, determining our behavior over space-time. First of all, the five, the heart, determines where we look, and so eight determines where we go, and how we sound, how we get on with each other. Then we're at the the, the heart again, the fifth. Then we come down to the sixth, seventh, and where that crosses the, the pillar of consciousness, the central line, is the is the stomach, the 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 the, the, the navel center. So remember, this is an extension of the body. So you've got the the zero at the top is the third eye. The first crossing. Sorry, the. The zero at the top is the thousand petal lotus above the top of the head. The where the one two crosses is the third eye, you know, the line on the surface. Where the three four crosses is the soundtrack, the audio signal, you know, the moving from space to space over time the actions over time. And then the six to seven is into the stomach and this is about working and collecting food, either being paid for work to get food or collect, actually collecting food. And so this, the six and seven dimensions are experienced in the stomach. Because the whole body-mind complex is a projection in mind, an extension in mind. And then obviously, you know, to be involved with real things in the present moment that we're collecting or working, we're, we're subject to, to gravity and to pressure. So this is the pressure triangle and number nine is gravity that puts us in a certain position. And that Nine is the body in a certain position, a posture, a kata, a preparedness for action, repetitive action, for ceaseless activity. So this is how the ten dimensions, how our body is extended in these ten dimensions. And are our minds and behaviors that are extended in these ten dimensions?